now. Your latest headlines and most accurate forecast from 41 Action News. Good morning, I'm Taylor Hemnes. Here are the headlines we're watching for you on this Wednesday morning, December the 30th. British drug maker AstraZeneca's vaccine has been authorized for emergency use in the UK. That shot's set to be rolled out next week. Officials say the approval follows rigorous clinical trials and a thorough analysis of the data by experts. Now here in the US, AstraZeneca still working to enroll 30,000 participants in its trial. Regionally, nearly 500 people have been enrolled in that trial, but it's now approved for emergency use in the UK. Some relief from the pandemic is on the way for a lot of Americans or will be soon. Some may already have direct deposits of that $600 payment from the coronavirus relief bill in their bank accounts this morning. The first round of paper checks are set to hit the mail today. All that according to the U.S. Secretary of Treasury. Senators set to vote on a veto override today for the U.S. defense spending bill, but Vermont Senator Bernie Sanders is threatening to delay that until Majority Leader Mitch McConnell allows a vote on increasing those stimulus payments to $2,000. He's joined in that effort by Josh Hawley, Republican Senator from Missouri. Snow Creek opens today for skiing and tubing at noon. They want to keep you safe on the slopes. You'll have to wear face masks indoors and out. Social distancing from other guests will be required and on-site transactions will be cashless. So be sure and take your card to pay for all your fun in the snow. Let's get to Wes Peary now for a look at your weather. Wes, uh, snow on the way, you think? Yeah, we have to wait until about Friday for that snow, though. We'll have clouds around this morning. Temperatures warming up today only into the upper 30s with some sunshine by this afternoon. And then, yeah, talking about some snow, maybe even some ice. In fact, probably some snow and some ice beginning Thursday night through Friday afternoon to Friday evening as temperatures will be hovering right near freezing. If it gets any colder than this on Friday, we'll have an even worse situations on our hand with the wintry weather. A little snow possible Saturday. You can get your news and weather anytime at KSHB.com.